with Pastor Dave. After you. So this is the first ride I've ever been on with my father. This should be fun. When I grew up here, all this used to be trees. Handlebars are a little crooked. I think from the fall, my handlebars are a little crooked. Oh. Oh, no oh, there you go. There you go. Okay, bud. <laughs> she just goes, eh? Wow, so this is my first time on a Harley and it's my father's heritage. I'm not sure what year it is. We'll figure that out in a bit Nice bike bud, holy oh jumping Wowzers I'm in love There's dad on the XS 650 back there Oh, right. Oh. Oh. It's turn signal. How do you Cancel. You good? <laughs> I'm in love.
going on over here? Oh, there's GFL here. I guess they're all the way across the country. You want this back? I think so. Yep. You're, I think you're more used to this. Than oh, for sure. I'm not used to this either. I stalled it at the stop sign back there. Oh yeah. Then I'm like, oh, and it has neutral. To be neutral. Yeah. Okay, it's yours. Oh yeah, neutral's hard to find. <laughs> Little, little touchy when it gets warm. Here you go. Yeah, I got it. Jeez, I, I, I'm not, I'm not sure of myself, <laughs> sure of myself whatsoever. Seriously. That is weird. <laughs> I just, I don't know. Well, you know the difference between this and that one. Oh, for sure. <laughs> it's like night and day. Yeah, absolutely. I gotta do it with my strap. Yeah. I was blowing in the wind here. Goes good though, eh? Very nice, I love it. Everybody that gets on, well, I've only let two people drive it, but you go from that to this, it's, it's like night and day. I definitely need a bigger bike. Yeah, exactly. All right, I'll follow you. Yeah. That was fun, yeah. thank you. Stop at McDonald's, watch the truck. Yep. Wait one by. Yep. Big difference. Well, that was absolutely fantastic. That was my first ride ever on a Harley. What a difference between this one and that one, wow. For sure. For sure. You must have noticed the difference right away. Fun little bike though. I definitely want something bigger. The difference is like, it's worse than night and day. <laughs> this is like getting on a sawhorse, first of all. <laughs> and everything shakes. Like, this thing's got rubber mounted so it doesn't shake like the old Harley. Absolutely, yep. It's, it's, it's absolutely, yeah. Well, this has rubber mounted everything, but that doesn't fix any of the shake. <laughs> so what year is this? This is a 2009 Heritage Classic. Softail Classic. Yeah. 96 cubes. You want, yeah. you want anything in this range, the six feet is the way to go. And six feet is the overdrive on this. I yeah. travel at 150 on the highway. 
And I'm only at 2,500 RPM. I don't think I got it out of fourth. No, exactly. No, you wouldn't. <clears throat> but this, but I couldn't believe. I, I'm, I'm lost for words. <laughs> When I said you would be spoiled, like you'd want to go up something like this. Oh, for sure. Your app, that's without a doubt. See, that's got a 26 inch height. This is only 23. Right. Right on. Put your hand, put your feet on the ground by sit, while sitting on the seat. Yeah. Let's go something with Yes, sir. Yep. Dear. <laughs> Nana and Riley. Ride back out to dad's place. Nice. So I'm not sure what year it was, but my brother Brendan bought a raffle ticket in Thunder Bay for that motorcycle. Or actually it was for a different motorcycle. And uh, I believe it was a Father's Day draw. My father's a pastor, so he was standing at the, uh, at the pulpit doing a Sunday morning service when his phone rang in his pocket and it just happened to be for this draw. They pulled his ticket and he won a Harley Davidson. Uh, it was a different bike that he won when he went to pick it up. He saw this one sitting beside it and I think it was maybe for an extra $3,000 they let him trade in the, the bike that he won for this beautiful heritage. That's such a nice bike. So brother Brendan's obviously the favorite brother at this point. Gonna be pretty tough to beat that present. Oh, we're getting a little sprinkle here. Take her easy boys, take her easy. Oh, a little splash here. Well, we're coming to the end pretty soon here of this trip to Kenora. Ah, time just flies way too fast when you're having fun. Let's catch this guy. It has been an absolute pleasure coming back. Loving every minute of it. Here we go, coming up on Dad's road here. Yes, sir. I don't, I don't think I've shown you the ski hill yet.
Now this is the old ski hill. It was really fun growing up out here. I think about three or four years in a row I had a full year or season passes for the ski hill. And there she is. In the summertime they do drive-in movies down here. Or they have been. I was hoping they were going to do it while we were in town, but haven't really seen any. Right on. The mighty Don Allen. Oh, it's good because the lens is dirty. <laughs> <laughs> 